Okay, so uh, welcome uh, to this interview. First, I'm going to ask you, you know, introduce yourself. Where are you? Where are you from? Okay, my name is Chibuke Raymond Possible. I'm from Nigeria. Mm -hmm. I come from the eastern part of Nigeria. Ibo. Mm -hmm. I'm Ibo. Um, Imo state precisely. Mm. Yes. And what, what should we know about Nigeria? What is what do you like doing there? Or what did um, you do there? Nigeria is very beautiful, like a lot of greenery. Mm -hmm. um, the food is amazing. Various, like it's so diverse. It's what is your favorite food? My favorite food mm -hmm. is called moi moi. Mm -hmm. So it's actually beans cake. That is lovely way they make it like you blend beans it's very complex i can't explain it now but it's very good and you can eat it with rice you can eat it with, like pap people even eat it with bread so that's how like everything about nigeria is very diverse like mm -hmm. the food the language the cultures everything mm. yeah. and uh, you keep to hungary when, when did you come to hungary i came to hungary in 2022 2022 yeah. and have you managed to find maybe more more in, in budapest or in seged or so far no mm -hmm. but they do have the so as, as i said it's made from beans mm -hmm. and they have this beans flour that they sell in the african market i just haven't made it yet mm -hmm. so well, fingers crossed <laughs> so i'm gonna make it yes all right uh so you came to hungary in 2022 yes. um, can you explain what you're doing here okay so um i was a student in Ukraine, mm -hmm. so I started schooling in Ukraine, medical school, and the war occurred, and thankfully I was able to come to Hungary and still continue my education, mm -hmm. yes, and so yes, I'm a medical student, but I'm currently in Seged, not mm -hmm. in the capital city, Budapest, but so far it's been good. Hungary has been good to me, so nice. I'm grateful. So did you have any, like, things like you like, you like doing in Seged, maybe? Yes, um, so I have a lot of friends, like mm -hmm. African friends in Seged. So, um, Seged is a small city, but I think that's the beauty in it. Like you can always decide, okay, today I want to go like to this restaurant. Like it's like a community. We have a community in Seged. So it's really lovely. Like we can go to like various restaurants. We can plan picnics. Like we know the, like the typical picnic mm -hmm. spots because we go there from time to time. So mm -hmm. it's lovely. Like Seged is, just the community and you can just do whatever you want with your friends. It's nice, nice yeah. to hear. Uh, obviously, why we're here kind of is that you, <laughs> I, th I feel like you won some competition maybe. Miss Afro Hungary. <laughs> <laughs> so, so you won, yes, obviously. I won, yes. uh, and uh, how did it feel uh, to win, to stand mm. on there on stage and, you know, be crowned the, the it, queen? It was, oh my God. <laughs> like reliving the moment now is just amazing. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm so grateful to have won. So, Winning, I was like, oh my god! <laughs> I was like, literally, that was what was in my heart. Like, oh my god! Like, I'm so happy. Like, yes, you know, like a girl from Seged. Yay! <laughs> did, you, did you expect to win? Um, did you like I hope to win, mm -hmm. but you know, yes, I expected to win. Everyone, every girl expected, like, wanted to win. Yeah, so I see. did expect to, to be like... yeah. So <laughs> I wanted to win. I was like, God, please, <laughs> you know. And so I'm very happy I was crowned yes. queen. Yeah. Congrats. Did you like, you. do you feel like different? Maybe you have a different outlook, you gain some more confidence that now you've won. Definitely. Found... Yes. Mm -hmm. So like, it's a huge platform and it's made me like gain confidence. Like, yes, like if you put your mind to anything, like it's possible. And it also made me like have it in mind, like you can balance various things. It doesn't always have to be school. It doesn't always have to be like your friends. You can... You can go out of your comfort zone basically mm -hmm. so like for things that you feel like oh what if i don't win still put yourself out there like there's something to learn in every situation so mm -hmm. that's the main thing mm -hmm. did you feel before maybe that you focused too much on school or, mm. uh, or friends or something yeah so One before going for this um before you know applying to be part of mm -hmm. the contestant for this pageant like i was like how am i going to balance it with school like I always felt like maybe school is the only path for me, but I'm so happy I put myself out there because then I also realized like, yes, you can also do it, you know, like we are women, we can multitask. So this is not new to us. So that's what I also learned. Nice. Yeah. And of course, winning me software comes with a, a platform that yes. you can use to, um, you know, if, for the important issues that you feel. Uh, so what, what would be something or what would you use the platform for in the next 12 months? Okay, so um, there are a lot of African businesses here mm -hmm. that people from, for example, people living in small cities like Ketchikemet or like Miss Calls, 
don't really know about, whether it be in Budapest, Debrecen, or Seged. Mm -hmm. So I'm using, I'm going to use this platform to showcase like, yes, like there are big businesses, good businesses, like you want to barb your hair, you don't have to look for like a Hungarian store, like Hungarian shop that maybe understands the texture of your hair. We have them here yeah. in Budapest, we have them in Seged. You're looking for various African foods, like for me, like we didn't have the... The African store we have in Seged doesn't have the beans flour, but I came to Budapest and I found it here. So bring awareness to various businesses, um, various issues like women's rights, and also like where a lot of beautiful women in Afri like from Africa that are here. Like this um, platform helped to show some of us, but a lot. So that's another thing. Like beauty, we're beautiful and we're also very smart. So main thing showcase African business. Um, also promotes the rights of women, you know, mm -hmm. that in various like relationships or marriages. Um, yeah, that's it. So that's showcasing nice. Africa, that's the main thing. So all right. Yeah. Uh, and I just only got one one last question for you. Okay. Uh, now you've won. Mm -hmm. uh, do you have any advice for anyone of the younger generation that might want to do it after you or just in general? Okay. Um, yes. My advice is like put yourself out there don't be too comfortable mm -hmm. like you feel like you can't do something you feel like oh what if like what if is in the minds of every human like being human you always have concerns but like the main thing is put yourself out there have that confidence talk to others if you feel like you're very shy because i was very shy but you know talking to other contestants you know being friendly like you have to be human be friendly like have communications with other people and then you realize like Oh, I'm just living in my own shell. Like there are people out here that are also doing this thing, and that's it. Put yourself out there. That's me. They have confidence. Talk to people, and you'll be fine. Put yes. yourself out there. Okay. Yes. Thank you so much. Thank you so much.